Hello there, welcome to the highlights of everything released in November 2022 by Modifius Entertainment. We'll get right on with it and start this month off with the Elder Scrolls Call to Arms, and these are the Bandit Outlaws, who are all about taking from the rich and keeping for themselves. They terrorise the roads and forests of Skyrim and will make light work of their foes. This set contains three Bandit Marauders and three Bandit Outlaws. Also adding to this month's general sense of lawlessness and disorder are the Bandit Pillagers, who comprise some of Skyrim's most wanted rogues and ne'er-do-wells. The set contains one Isa Blackthorn, one Rigel Strongarm, one Rawlack, and three Bandit Plunderers. Now we have a subtle change of location as we head from Skyrim to Star Trek Adventures and the next generation Klingons STL set. These are STL reissues of the amazing Klingons resin set, available to buy as a group or individually for you to print at home. And this particularly honourable set contains one captain, three lieutenants and four warriors. In a similar vein we also have the original series landing party STLs. Just like the Klingons, these are print at home STLs that can be bought as a group or individually. Available are male and female versions of Andorians, Denobulans, Tellarites, and Vulcans, as well as two humans or any other humanoid species you care to paint them as. Finally, Star Trek Adventures this month is the latest mission brief Mysteries. Space exploration is a treasure trove for the curious, and there is no shortage of strange and wondrous things out there in the cosmos and a spacefaring crew will regularly be faced with mysteries of all kinds. This packet presents 10 detailed mission briefs oriented around a variety of mysteries, each of which you can modify for use in your Star Trek Adventures campaigns. Next we stop off at the Wasteland with the Red Rocket drive through STL set, an iconic feature of pre-war life evolving from offering gas to fusion and coolant refilling services. This STL set allows you to print your own Red Rocket drive through station as well as some associated scatter to really immerse yourself in the classic Fallout setting. It contains one mini Red Rocket gas station, a Red Rocket garage, two forecourt canopy designs and themed scatter. And considering what some of the other releases for Fallout Waste and Warfare are this month, it's probably good to have somewhere to hide in the wasteland. These are Stingwings, giant mutated distant cousins to the modern scorpion fly, but much, much larger, with a vicious sting in their tail. The set contains one glowing Stingwing and two standard Stingwings. What's that you say? You want more insects? Well, okay then. These are the blood bugs. Following the Great War, the mosquitoes in the Massachusetts swamps mutated into blood bugs the size of a dog, which is about as good as it sounds. This set contains three blood bugs. Now the rules and stats for these new sets can be found in the Forged in the Fire rules expansion. Every set from this wave is covered here, including creatures, raiders, survivors and super mutants. It consists of a booklet containing rules for expanding your options on the battlefield, 259 new cards, 5 new scenarios, faction rules and strategy guides for the two new sub-factions, which are the Slog and the Forged, and unit rules for Ghouls. Last but not least for Fallout Waste and Warfare is Into the Wasteland, an expansion that provides players with new rules to really explore the wasteland. It consists of a 24-page booklet, 112 cards, new areas to scavenge and explore, new AI rules for creatures and areas, and To the Rescue, a mini-campaign. Finally for November, we take a look at the new card decks for Dune Adventures in the Imperium. The Architect and Agent decks both come with 56 cards, and the Architect deck covers the various assets a master manipulator such as yourself might use to destroy their enemies from afar. Meanwhile, the Agent deck details the assets you would use to face your enemies. Each card fully details an individual asset, giving you everything you need at your fingertips when fighting for the honour of your house. And there we go, those are the highlights of everything released from Modiphius in November of 2022, wrapped up into a nice little concise package for you. You know what's coming next? I'm about to ask you to hit subscribe because you'd get all the new updates and sneak peeks, as well as chat with us on our forums and Discord, the links are below. And if that wasn't enough to check us out on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. Hope November was a good one for you. We'll see you again at the end of December. Bye for now.